Welcome back everyone and we are here at the Midland Country Club and we are here in anticipation of the Dow Great Lakes Bay Invitational and I have two participating players with me this morning. We have both um, Pernilla Lindbergh and Maria Fossey. Thank you both for being here this morning. It's so exciting. You guys have both committed to returning to the Invitational and uh, you get partners. So have you chose your partners and uh, what are you looking forward to the most about returning to this event? I'll start with you. Yeah, uh, I have chosen my partner. Uh, I'm going to be playing with Sarah Jane Smith from Australia. She was not here two years ago because she was giving birth actually that month. Uh, so I know uh, she'll be excited to see the tournament for the first time. I will be excited to return to the event because uh, 2019 was awesome. I was already excited to come back in 2020 and now I've had to wait another year. So uh, I'm sure uh, all of Midland will be excited to, to have an event here and I know they're gonna come out and support us uh, and we haven't had that many fans uh, out watching our events yet so uh, that's probably what I'm looking forward to the most just having everyone out here yeah absolutely that's got to be exciting and for you your partner what are you looking forward to the most yeah I'm playing with Stacy Lewis so we'll have a couple of Razorbacks come and, and take on Midland Country Club and I'm excited excited to play with her uh, I mean former number one player in the world I know I can learn a lot from her and just have a great time I love the course I love the community like Pernilla was saying I think everybody's very excited to come back the people here are very excited to have us back so I know it's gonna be a great week and uh, I just can't wait to be back uh, for the tournament yeah, I'm sure for you guys it's exciting just to get back in uh, on the green and, and hearing the crowd too. That always plays a difference. Now, what made you and your partner, uh, for both of you, decide to team up uh, for this year's tournament? Uh, Sarah Jane is one of my best friends on tour, and I actually did ask her back in 2019, and it was when she, when I asked her that she told me she was pregnant, <laughs> and that's actually ah, how I found out. Nice. <laughs> so she wasn't going to be able to make it back then, uh, so it was kind of uh, just uh, felt natural that we would team up this uh, this time instead. Now, for your partner, do you think uh, her being number one player kind of took part in that decision making? <laughs> oh, for me, it was easy. I think it was, uh, I don't know why she chose me, but I'm happy she did. <laughs> uh, I think it's, it's just cool to play with her. It's somebody I, I look up to very much. She's been a great mentor to me on tour. Uh, we're good friends. And like I said before, just a couple of Razorbacks. Uh, wanting to do cool things again uh, together and I'm, I'm excited I think it's gonna be a, a fun week and um, like I said before I'm just excited to learn from her have a good time and um, I'm, I'm very excited to play with her good good I, I'm excited for both of you uh, as well now of course these are teams so is there a benefit to playing with a partner compared to playing solo uh, it's just different, I would say. It probably makes it more fun because uh, we play, it's an individual sport. We play individually, you know, every other week of the year. Uh, so it just uh, kind of brings a different uh, vibe to, to everything. But uh, it's, if you're playing great, you can kind of feed off each other. But uh, it can also be tough if you're not playing so good because uh, suddenly you feel like you don't want to let your partner down. So it can for sure go both ways. Noria, did you want to add to that? Yeah, I think it's it's different and, and each player can bring something different to the table. You're playing, especially when it's uh, alternate shot, it's she's playing maybe from distances that, like Stacy will play from distances that she hasn't played before. I'll play from distances that I ha don't usually play from. So it's it's a challenge to kind of get both games to, to match up and, and be good. But I think it's just more about uh, being together, having a good time, uh, enjoying each other, enjoying the crowds. Like Pernilla was saying, we haven't had uh, as, as many out there this year. So it's just fun, a fun week. And uh, I think it'll be, it'll be great. Absolutely. Now, uh, you could probably see behind us the hashtag team up, which I know has been the theme for this year's uh, tournament. So what does it mean to you uh, to really team up with the par your partner or anybody? Yeah, I uh, I think uh, going back again to golf being son, such an individual sport that we really embrace those weeks when we do get to team up because uh, golf can be a pretty pretty lonely sport, especially <laughs> on tour, I think. Uh, so, uh, and I think uh, especially the, after the times that we've been going through, you know, a lot of people, uh, and same for us on tour, it's mm -hmm. kind of been, uh, you know, kind of lonely out there. You've had to isolate yourself a lot. So why not uh, kind of focus on that team up aspect? It'll be nice. Yeah, how about you, Maria? Yeah, I think uh, it, it, things that are done in, in a group are usually better. So it's exciting that 
we get that opportunity on the golf course. Uh, we don't really ever get it, so it's nice to have a tournament that also showcase uh, that aspect of life and, and just playing with somebody else, I think, uh, can bring the, the best from, from both players. And it's, it's a different approach to golf. And I think it's a lot of fun to, to play and also a lot of fun for people to watch and uh, interact with us. You know, I'll say uh, with teams, it's good for moral support, I bet, being mm -hmm. out there as well, because you, you never know what could go wrong. So uh, <laughs> I, I have to ask a, a, a question on the more casual side, because we all want to know, like, if you guys chose your walk-up song. <laughs> oh, we have not gotten that far yet. Uh, we, uh, that's that and a team name is actually something we're still working on. Yeah. So okay. if anyone has any input, yeah. hit us up. You heard it here <laughs> first. How about you, Maria? I'm the same way. I've, I've had a, a couple of song ideas. Uh, haven't told Stacy about them okay. yet. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe I'll... I'll tell her she takes care of the name and I'll take care of this song and just have her listen to it the first time on 18 and see her reaction. I think that could be kind of fun too. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Keeping it surprising. Uh, thank you both for being here with us and answering some of these questions. I wish you lots of luck and uh, exciting for you guys. I'm excited for you guys to get back out there, especially in front of a crowd. So yeah, you don't want to miss it. The Dow Gray Lakes Bay Invitational and you'll see these two plus more.